Man, this ending, or I mean, this part—they're yeah, just. Locked. What should we do? They're just—they're not pulling Isn't any punches. Hey, <sighs> quit dawdling. Here we go. Mm. One, two. That was cool. That was new. Whoa. There he is. Hmm. Who are these masters? Who are these guys? <laughs> Chicken dance? <laughs> Are you serious? Is that that should just about do it? The rest is up to you. I like that. How are we even friends? Oh my god. That's hilarious. This is great. Messed it up. Messed it up. Oh well. Oh well. Oh, I don't know. I was enjoying myself a little too much. Like, I was so mesmerized with all the stuff so that's no going mercy. on. Yes, ma'am. This is crazy. What's she doing? Burning it down. No, oh, yeah. Yeah, that's right. That fool. The Chiyo men belong to me now. <laughs> I'll burn Landi and the rest of it down. <laughs> huh. Is she the new big baddie or what? What's going what? <laughs> it seems you've improved a bit. Oh, that voice is that voice is okay, Landy. but it's... fight me. I will avenge my father. That voice needs work, though. It, it, it just seems like it's from Resident Evil, though. That's the thing. That's my only beef with it. Wow, he's huge. He really... Oh, he's gonna kill me no matter what. I think. Ah! Like, my health is like red. I don't. Know. Ah! 
is he so good? Like, before, wasn't it still a battle? Like, a. Damn! You really have a death wish, don't you? Where's Shenmue, too, and all then this? Then allow me to reunite you with your father. Hey! Isn't this what you're after? Let go of him, and I'll let you have it. Oh. Here. Damn it. You're no good to anyone, Dad. Let's get out of here. No. Lendy. Son, that's oh, that's cool. Okay, I had no idea who she was. I didn't see was Shenhua there. So, Chi Yu Min, Chi Yu Min. Yeah, okay. Hmm. Save Shenhua. This is Zhao Sun Ming. You know him? The man next to him is my father. My father was killed by Lan Di. Lan Di. He suddenly appeared in the dojo and stole the dragon mirror. Then he killed my father. The dragon mirror, stolen by Landi. It has the same design as a relief I saw in your quarry. Something so terrible happened because of the mirror my family created. Please, tell me if you know anything. The Dragon Mirror and the Phoenix Mirror were once locked away in the Cliff Temple. But someone had their eye on them. They were the Chiryo Men. Zhao Sun Ming wanted to retrieve the mirrors before they fell into the wrong hands. He's the man standing next to your father. <coughs> the mirrors were entrusted to him. Several years later, Zhao died under mysterious circumstances. A 
His only son, Long Sun, was raised by the Chiyo men. Long Sun? Zhao Long Sun, also known as Lan Di. The cliff temple that Zhao visited. That's where we found the scroll. I heard the Chi Yo men have taken it over. So, Londi is there? Most likely, with the mirror. Do you smell that? Because my nose is pointing to treasure. My treasure. Oh, that's funny. He does not know of the strength hidden within him. The strength that would destroy him. The strength that would fulfill his wishes. You'd better not run, Landi. I will avenge my father. Okay, so if uh, completed game data is loaded, you can start from Bailu Village or Nyawu and um, items, money, tokens, skill books, skill levels, practice levels, and Kung Fu levels will be carried over. Okay, that is pretty awesome. I will save it in this last one. Wow. So, we made it after, um, after all those, after all those days of gameplay. So, huh, it's like day 11, I'm, you know, almost two hours in, and, um, I think I did most of everything in the game. Uh, there's a few side quests that I didn't do, but it was probably, on average, four Four hours a day, so 40. It's like a 40 hour game. Okay. That makes sense. All right. That was, uh, that was, that was pretty cool, man. That, the ending was, uh, really intense. I like how there are some, like, Matrix undertones to it with the, uh, you know, come here kind of thing. And then, like, you're fighting all the guys in suits on the bridge. So that was interesting. That was cool, though. It was cool because it was like you felt, that Rio was actually with Ren together again, fighting up to no good, mischief, and um, they could just like punch out a few dudes, quite a few dudes, like 20, 20 to 50 dudes on their way up to this big, huge temple. Um, you got introduced to that. I got introduced. This is the first time I knew about that um, Chi Yu Min uh, character, that girl that's bad. Huh. It's crazy because like she's like this mysterious girl early on and then she turns out to be this evil chick um but yeah so there's her to think about um there's landy to think about um yeah i heard they ended this game where it could kind of like end the story but i didn't feel that i didn't feel like the story is remotely even close to being ended which i guess is good news because then that means that we're just gonna be getting to play um, another Shenmue at least if not two more hopefully it's two more but um, yeah the story was really good um, it was really fun to be in the role again of Ryo Hazuki but it feels like 
feels like it was just a little bit, I mean, I know they only had so much budget and they only had so much to work with, but it feels like the pacing was a little like, I just, I just, I didn't know how far along I was in the story because it just seemed what I was trying to accomplish wasn't on the grand scheme of things that major. Like I, you know, you defeat some thugs at the hideout, you run into, um, gosh, what's that? Gollum creature guy again. Uh, you run into him like th four or five times. Um, I mean, you bump into Ren, and then you meet the girl that that girl um, Ling Shu, Ling Xing or Lu Xing or the girl, the mysterious girl that turns out to be a Chi Yu Men character, uh, bad guy. But I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I I did I did see that there was um, there was some some stretch goals that they had in there that if they made um in the campaign the fund the funding uh the uh, kick it was kickstarter or gofundme campaign the what whichever uh campaign it was i don't think it was indiegogo but whichever campaign uh crowdfunding campaign it was there were a couple milestone goals to have different um levels and and areas added to the game so i'm sure that that would have definitely added um, I'm not saying that it, yeah, like it was a fantastic game and, um, they had a lot of different stuff added to it. So yeah, it was definitely, definitely worth the buy easy hands down. Um, and, uh, yeah, I'm just waiting for my, uh, my, uh, my, uh, Kickstarter perk to be received in the mail. Because the I ordered the soundtrack and the soundtrack was awesome, so I'm really, really excited to to be listening to that and whatnot. But yeah, that was a um, that was an eventful game. That was a good game. That was really cool. Just curious to see if there's anything at the credits. Although I guess. I don't know. I don't know if this is all the backers. I haven't been paying t t attention to the screen. If if all the backers have shown up yet, I'm curious to see if I if my name was on there or if I put it as anonymous. I can't remember. But yeah, that's cool. That was uh, that was yeah, that was a good game. Yeah, I know. It's 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 one of those things where it's just like you never would think that in a million years it would come back right and it's kind of like i mean for me even like i mean like 15 years after i last played shenmue 2 i was like oh they're doing a kickstarter this is crazy like because like you know maybe like i didn't like forget about the game but it's not like i i had high hopes that there was going to be a, another game in the sense that i just thought it was kind of um I don't know. It wasn't finished, obviously, but it was just the way it ended at that point at the end of Shenmue 2. I just, I just, I was okay with where we had gotten to. But now that we do get this game, it is just mind blowing. It's fantastic. It's awesome to see where the story went and to learn all that we've learned throughout this third chapter. So it's pretty awesome. And I just, I think there's a lot. That they can, I think I I see now where they can definitely expand on the the story and like there's at least two more games worth of material in it if there was if there is slash be, um, becomes funding. So yeah, although I don't think my name would be in the credit too because I think I got one of the slacker backer perks that was um, just kind of one off nothing nothing too special there to all the fans who have waited many years for Shenmue 3 and to all the crowdfunding backers who have made this game possible this project would not exist without your love support and connect and the connections we have made along the way with profound appreciation for all that you have done I am happy to finally present to you Shenmue 3 
During development, I expanded the scope beyond what I had originally envisioned. I am happy we were able to include the distinct Shenmue charm throughout this game. Yes, that's definitely... this Without a question, the Shenmue charm is here in this game, and it's been even expanded further, and it fits nicely. So I have to give them huge kudos for that. I hope that this new chapter strikes even a small resonance in your heart. I think anybody who played Shenmue 1 and 2... Or, or of them, either of them, will think that this game is a phenomenal nod to those uh, predecessors. For as long as there are those who wish to see Shenmue live on, I will never give up on my own personal journey to complete its story. As with Shenmue 3, the Shenmue story is with you. I sincerely hope that together we can continue to spin the tale of Ryo and his adventures in Shenmue 4. This goes out to all who have ever loved and supported Shenmue. Awesome. 